Kim Jong-un is one of South Korean actors who stole people's hearts with his great and impressive acting. He is better known from his role in Crash Landing on You wherein he portrayed the character of Alberto Gu. Beside that 16 episodes drama, he raised his fame with several other dramas, like Rebel Thief Who Stole the People, School 2017, Welcome to Waikiki, and his recent performance in Mr. Queen. He made people heart flutter with his good looking and handsome as he is. Check out these 10 things you must know about this talented South Korean actor. He started from musical theater. The starting point for the actor is also the play field. Kim's career began when he acted in several musical theaters before he moved on to the screen. He first stepped onto the theater stage with the performance Therese Raquin in 2013. In an interview he said, I find out acting is a valuable job that allows us to give and receive emotions from others. It's attractive since it's able to help us share new experiences. As a result, he officially started walking the path of an actor. He has completed his military service. Every healthy man in South Korea have to enter military for two years. For entertainers, they fear to be forgotten by the community during the service. Also fans would be sad for their absence on screen. But Kim Jong-un's fans need not worry because he has already completed his military service. He has completed it when he was 21 years old before he joined entertainment industry. Through an interview, he said, I think I've done well in my youth. Instead of fear, I feel more excited. He received the Best New Actor Award in 2017. Thanks to his hard work, Kim was awarded the Best New Actor Award at the 2017 MBC Drama Award. It was held on December 30 to celebrate the great accomplishments that were made in MBC dramas for the year. Kim won a Best New Actor Award for his role as Mori in Rebel Thief Who Stole the People. The drama was the biggest winner of the night, with the cast and crew taking home a total of nine awards, including Drama of the Year and Best Scriptwriter of the Year. He couldn't choose one of all characters he played. As an actor, he has tried many different types of characters. But when he was asked which character he liked the most, he couldn't pick one. I love all the characters I have played. They have some good and bad things. They are all in my heart and so precious to me. Also when he was asked by fans which character he closely resembled, he couldn't pick one. He said, all the characters have a bit like me. If I choose one that looks the most like me, the other characters will get hurt. You understand, right? He had an eating and sleeping disorder. In 2018, he was forced to quit his leading role in the MBC television series Time because of his eating and sleeping disorder. His agency, O and Entertainment said, he has been receiving treatment while shooting the drama, he did not want to cause harm to the drama. The actor and crew tried their best to keep going until the end, but Kim had to quit midway through after his doctor told him he needed to have a mental and physical break. He plays Suho who has a severe illness because he had to leave while filming wasn't over, his character was made dead in the drama. The actor was reported to have been in trouble because of attitude problems. During a press conference, he remained expressionless throughout and even refused to link arms with Sohyun, his co-star in the MBC television series Time. Back in the spotlight. Not wanting to break down, Kim decided to forget his controversy and start over. Acting is what revived him and he feels extremely grateful as long as he can act. He is returning in a big way, starring with top stars Yun Bin and Son Ni Jin in Crash Landing on You. He mentioned it was surreal acting with the two A-listers. He starred in the drama as Gu Soong Joon or Alberto Gu, a con artist whose living purpose is money and revenge. Despite bearing the pain due to not receiving the love of his parents, he is a naive and pure guy in love. This is a role with a huge emotional difference in the drama when he tries to hide in North Korea. Kim's character name Gu Soon Joon went on to trend at number one in Korea's real-time search rankings, an unexpected occurrence that he described as both surprising and incredibly rewarding. In an interview for Harper's Bazaar magazine, he said, I was shocked. Of course, it's nice to see my name being searched, but as an actor, I was also really proud to see a character of mine receive so much interest. When asked to name a moment in which he experienced the popularity of his drama firsthand, the actor said, Once, I went to a restaurant and some older women asked me when I had come down from North Korea. So I told them I just made my way down. He declared that he was hoping to enjoy a long and fulfilling acting career in the future. Crash Landing on You was a turning point in his life. Thanks to Crash Landing on You, he was able to get past a 17-month period where he was physically and mentally unwell and unable to love himself. He said, it was a time when I had been berating myself as both a person and an actor. 
I was having a really hard time then, to the point where I thought, why am I living? Every moment was like I was standing at the edge of a cliff. One day, I suddenly realized that I was being too hard on myself. I felt that because I wasn't able to live well at the moment, I would continue to feel like I was at the edge of a cliff in the future. Once I realized that, I tried to focus on the present and the people around me. He said crash landing on you was a drama that helped him find hope. What I'm most thankful for is that I learned that I'm someone who can be loved as well. I regained a lot of self-esteem. PDE Zhang Yo just said to me, let's have fun, and that gave me a lot of strength. I've never been contacted so much from friends' parents asking me to come over for dinner. He gets more fans for his role in Mr. Queen. Week after week during TVN's hit drama Mr. Queen aired, he has stolen viewers' hearts with his impressive acting as the multifaceted Cholzhong, who has become increasingly intrigued by the sudden change in his queen's behavior. He expressed his gratitude to the drama's viewers, being able to gift viewers with laughter in this difficult time was a huge joy for me, so much so that I couldn't ask for anything more. I'm truly grateful to the viewers who took the time out of their busy lives to watch Mr. Queen and made it possible for me to be a part of their lives through the drama, even for a little bit. He released songs. Kim starred in a movie Stay With Me, also known as Meet the Memories, in 2018. Not only starred in the movie, he also lent his voice for the original soundtrack of the movie, Moonlight. Then he played the role of King Choljong in a comedy drama, Mr. Queen, which always achieves high ratings. On February 12, 2021, Big Ocean ENM announced that Kim will participate to fill in the soundtrack of Mr. Queen and received a positive response. Actor Kim Jong-yoon who plays Chol Jong took part in the song Like the First Snow. The track will be released on February 17. Like the First Snow is described as a song with an emotional melody and heart-wrenching lyrics that express the desperate feelings of a man who wants to be with someone during the first snowfall. Not only did Kim sing the track, but he also personally wrote lyrics for the song as well. He's trying to learn English. Kim's recently goal is to study and focus on learning English, and it is undoubtedly for acting. He wants to reach all fans from various countries and be able to act using English. He revealed, if I am good at English, I will have access to more works. I want to try many roles and bring them to the audience. He got advice to learn English from actor Park Myung-hoon, who appeared in Parasite and told him to prepare in advance.